Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Henry Edward Page was born a slave in Warrington, Virginia, on his day, December 29, 1853. In 1863, a Union forces neared the plantation where he and his parents were enslaved. The family seized the opportunity to escape to freedom. Page moved to Washington, D.C., where he worked and financed his education at local private schools, including the forerunner of Howard University. Page became one of the first African Americans admitted to Brown University and was one of the first two African Americans to graduate from an Ivy League school. Page gave the valedictorian address at the 1877 commencement at Brown and members in the audience that day recruited him to accept a teaching position at the Natchez Seminary. After leaving Natchez, Page will serve as president of Missouri Western Baptist College and Tennessee Roger Williams University. Page served as principal of Oklahoma City Segregated Back School for 12 years. Today, the main library at Lincoln University in Jefferson City, Missouri, bears his name. I am Kanye Rollins, a fifth grade student at West Elementary, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.